Thank you, sir. You are welcome, Thank you, sir. I was told you want to see me. Yes, sir. Okay, no problem. Not at all. Uh, my name is uh, Chef Uh God led me to this church. That uh, the next project by the church would like to remark upon. God said I should champion it financially. That's why I'm here, sir. The Lord told you that? Yes, sir. It's okay. I hope you are a Christian. By God's grace, I am. And you are calling it. By the grace of God. No problem. As soon as we have got the direction from God, we let you go. Thank you so much, sir. You're welcome. Yes, sir. As you know that I'm not a member of this church. This is my card. As soon as the church is ready, I'll be glad to hear from you, sir. No problem. Thank you so much, sir. We we'll get in touch with you at the Lord give us direction. He said you led him to finance a project. The Lord lead him in his life in the name of Jesus. Amen. Bless him in the name of Jesus. Amen. Establish his salvation to the kingdom of God in the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Father. Thank you. In Jesus' name we are praying. Amen. Thank you, brother. Thank you so much. Sir. Sir. Thank you so much. Hello? Yes, call me next person. I've not responded to their persistent request. It seems they have made up their mind about it. And this request of theirs is mounting pressure. I don't really know what to do. Uh, As a matter of fact, you shouldn't venture into such adventure without a go ahead from the Savior. Let him guide you. Let him lead you. You see, leadership is ordained of God. And any leadership position occupied is by privilege, which shall be accounted for on the last day. That's why I pity so many who see leadership as an opportunity to feed their ego and uh, 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 mess around. It is not like that. See, some even see it as an opportunity to become thieves. Brother Eleven. If the people of Ola Guriaji community wants you to become their leader, their chairman in the next political dispensation, and if it pleases God, then go ahead, but make it an opportunity to prove to them that Jesus is the best leader any community can have. I will pray with you. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you for your fatherly and God's work. Let us go. Father in Jesus' name. Daddy, sir, I, I, I hope you've received it. That is the uh, tithe and offering report for last Sunday at the midweek service, sir. Exactly. 
that is what I'm going to just checking it up. The Sunday and weekly services from branches in Lagos and outside Lagos. Yes, sir. Exactly, sir. That is good. And the Liberty Camp Development Offering from Lagos and outside Lagos too. Exactly, sir. This is good. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Ah, the tides. This is also good. Glory be to God. Thank God, sir. Thank you, sir. And I must confess, Mr. Akagela, you did a very good job. Thank you very much, sir. With your computations. Thank you very much, sir. It is well outlined. Thank you, sir. I pray that the Almighty God, the God of heaven, will reward your labor of love in his kingdom accordingly in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise God. Hallelujah. Oh, we thank God. Mr. Kajola. Yes, sir. You are not a baby in Christ. You should know that Amen is a seal of prayer. I just prayed for you that my God, the God of heaven, will reward your labor of love in his kingdom accordingly and bless you in Jesus' name. Amen! Amen! Amen in Jesus' name! Hello, the King Ladadi. How are you? God bless and increase you in Jesus' name. Oh, God bless you. Thank you very much. Um, please, check your account uh, back. I just sent you. I just make a transfer to you. Yes, that's your own share of the deal. All right, thank you very much. And please tell Sister Rachel to also check her account balance. Yes, I I transferred her own share as well. Thank you very much. God bless you. Amen. Amen. Thank you. Ah. <laughs> Hello, bro. God bless you. How are you? Oh, you have received it. That's good. That's your own share of the deal. Thank you very much. God bless you. Oh, see you at this feet watching uh, service later in the day. Thank you. Take care. My regards to the family. All right. Bye. Wow. <laughs> Mr. Chairman, sir, please, the people of Olagori Aje local government, they are earnestly requesting you to come to their rescue. In fact, they are even saying it is either you or no one. They are eagerly expecting your response. Is it the ball walls that are dug everywhere hmm. as a result of your influence? Or the youth empowerment program hmm. that we want to talk about? What about the payment of the JSS and SS3 school fees, which were made by you? Chairman, the widows, the farmers, and everyone. They are expecting you. Please don't say no. <clears throat> Do you know that you have become the talk of the people yes. in the town? Yes. In fact, what they are saying is, Elebenikon Lodeshe. Mr. Chairman, our party and the people of Ola Goriaje. Believe that if you are given a political mandate to lead us mm. in no time, these our local government or laboratory will soon become small London <laughs> in this country. 
Thank you so much. I really appreciate you. Um, I have prayed about it. And God has given me the express go mm -hmm. <laughs> to submit myself for his use in all that glory and joy. Evangelist Michael, what exactly is your problem? Do I need to go on my meal before you come to your senses? This is the fifth time I'm bringing this same issue up with you. You know you are not doing this for free. I've promised you a lot of juicy packages that will, you know, you will get it from me if you can wake up and not just only that. I will also enforce your promotion in this ministry. Your story will change from that uh, being one pastor in the village, but that of influential pastor in this ministry. Eh? Don't you get it? You will no longer be in the village, but in the mega city of your choice. Mm, mm, mm. Stop. Stop! Stop, Joe! What's all this? What? Stop mumming me! Huh? My name is Busayo. Busayo. Ah. The same Busayo you were dating when we were in school. What? Michael Johnson, honestly, I'm deeply in love with you, and there's nothing you can do to that. <sighs> Jesus! <laughs> Stolen water, Aki Ah, uh, good day, everybody. Um, I have my reasons. For bringing this meeting to this secluded place. And then, um, before we commence with this meeting, I want us to do something very important. Please, you all should bring out your phones. All your phones are in, and switch it off. And drop them close to me here. Dikin Kajola. Look with this, your tactics. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Is that all our friends? Look, if I dreamt and I saw myself giving myself food, I can't trust myself. Hmm. Not to talk about you. Hmm. Um, thank you very much, everybody. We all know how God has been blessing us, the God of this commission, through our deals and uh, so now we uh, collect the, uh, our own cuts from the tithes, pledges, um, gifts, and contrast in the church. Um, however, I think it is very, very important and urgent for us to change our strategies of how we 
make our own cuts from these uh, collections. Um, the can uh, I did here almost got cuts last Sunday. It was not an interesting event at all. Only the saving grace of uh, Bradu's wisdom bailed me out. But then, I was able to accomplish my purpose anyway. Ha! Thank God, though. Yeah? Oh. But, Dickin Kajola, I feel that you should have a way of enticing and um, involving all the cashiers that are working with you and you are supervising in the headquarters. No, 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 no. That would be a wise decision. Mm -hmm. Yes, I think the fewer we are in this business, the better. Okay. I concur with you 100%. However, there is somebody I will want us to work on. Mm -hmm. And that is the new assistant accountant. Ah, that man? What about him? I've heard a lot about him. In fact, I don't think uh, he will be willing to join us in this business. I heard he's an SU, a conk one for that matter. SU. Sister Rachel, how do you mean? Is it not Mr. Isholarika? SU. Then, if he is an SU, then the devil will be a better SU. I beg you, all of us will be thief. Excuse me, all of us, we are thieves. Uh, 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 please, sister, uh, can you just come more open a little more? Let's, I want to understand what you are talking about. You seem to know him very much. For all of you's information, Mr. Isholarika and I were together from last night till daybreak this morning at Honeybrook's Hotel. Jesus! Mr. Ishola is my man friend. Jesus! That young looking as you. It's not by look so. For any way, just leave him for me. Eh? I'll be landing. Ah, that was my girl. You can sub your eyes out. I don't care. Mine is that you should just stop wasting your time. You are a woman! I'm very sure you will reach menopause. Is it this a religion of a thing that has torn your head and has made you to be brainless? Eh? Ten good years in marriage. Eh? You've been married for ten good years without a child. And you sit down comfortably with that old man that doctors have confirmed of having low span count. Hmm? Ah, okay. Uh, you are waiting and trusting God together with him, Abby. Hmm. Well, I just hope it will not be too late before you open your eyes. <laughs> Come to think about it. <laughs> eh, it appears that you are happy there. I call it Mommy Gio, Mommy Gio, Mommy Gio. Eh, you don't enter your brain, Abby. You are happy. Hey, I just hope that this your mommy Gio will not turn to Mommy, go out! Mm, that time, you will know. Is it a sin that your husband is, uh, is having low span cans? And so? Is it a crime? Get out there and look for a young, agile man with full span cans. Get yourself pregnant for your husband, period! Ah! I. Ah! Sister, you have been saying this, but it's not easy. Ah! It's not easy. Can you easy? What is not easy? Even the young, the young parts are approaching my church, you know, it's proving stubborn, too stubborn. There's nothing I can do. Ah! Then, threaten him! 
show him the type of money he has never seen before. Better still, you set him up. Set him, set him up. Good morning, ma. Hello, Michael. How are you? Uh, fine, ma. I, I, how is daddy, ma? <sighs> daddy is fine. He's still in Oklahoma for the two weeks we are learning. Daddy said you should represent him in a program that is going on at a high class hotel by 10 p.m. tomorrow. It's a program for for the African uh, missionaries uh, period. And he wants you to you know to go there to represent him. Okay ma. God bless you. Amen ma. You can't take it away. No, you cannot take it away. My no. Dear. What happened? What is it? I saw you in a dream giving out your PSC certificate to a woman. The woman was so excited taking it from you. Besides, I saw her giving you some gift in exchange of your certificate. And she went away happily with it. Then I saw myself running after her, shouting on top of my voice that no, she can't take it away. She can't take it away. Oh. Oh. <clears throat> my dear, <clears throat> this is strange. You, you said you saw that I give away my certificate to a strange woman. Yes. Um, were you able to see the face of the woman? Of course. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Who? I mean, who is the woman? Yeah. The painful thing is, I can't remember her face. But it's a known face. <sighs> That's all right. You see, my dear. Don't disturb yourself. This is just a dream. It's a mere dream. Mm. You see, the truth of the matter is that my BSc certificate is not useful for any other person. Yeah, I disagree with you. This is not a mere dream. I, no, this is the third time of 
me having a dream, seeing a woman collecting something valuable from you. Mm. Ah, but it's still a dream. Yes, it's a dream. But it is not an ordinary one. Well, whatever. There is a liar. Let's pray. I'm actually surprised I can't find any of your staff on site. What happened? Uh, today is our off day. Okay. By 7 o'clock tomorrow morning, everybody will be here. Okay, okay. Because you see, I want this house dedicated in another um, six months there about. Sure, sure. Sh you are uh, assuring me that that is achievable. Yes. yes. Ah, okay, my dear. This is what the Lord has made for us. Wow! This is good. Thank you. Thank you. You can you. say that again, my dear. You can say that again. Thank you. I'm even surprised that everything is just falling in places of their own accord. This God is faithful. You see, that is what I call supernatural blessings. God is just blessing us all. Hallelujah. <laughs> By the time that Miss Angela, they will come back from school. Oh, See, we have been set to move into our own mansion. That is properly planned out. You see, in about five, six months thereabout, they'll be ready to come home on vacation. Mm. And just two weeks after they arrived, the house dedication. I guess they are um, with it. Hey, I'm here, I'm set to go. Okay, sir. Please, I'm here for the prayer program scheduled to hold here tonight. Prayer program? Yes. So I'm not sure there's any program that you said. I mean, the prayer conference of all African missionaries scheduled to hold here this night. So there's no program like this? Really? No, there's no. We don't have any program that you want to do. Excuse me. Good evening, ma'am. Right. I'm already at the reception of the hotel, ma'am. But I'm surprised to hear that there's no prayer program holding here tonight, ma'am. Yes, I just got that a few minutes too. A few minutes ago. That the venue has been changed. In fact, Sister Dimika and I, we are in room 11. Room 11. So, you can come upstairs. So, from here, from here, we go together to the change training. Alright. As the reception is that you are going to room 11. Okay. I'll be there. Can you direct me to room 11? Upstairs, by the left side, the top of the room. Yes, thank you. Thank you. Very good. Mission. Mommy, what's going on here? Where is Sister Jibika? <laughs> Why don't you bring Jibika for now? Don't tell me this is a kind of a setup or what? <laughs> Micah, you talk too much. See, we are starting our meeting right away. <laughs> listen and listen good. Whatever happens now determines your destiny. And if you shout, I will tear my dress. Huh. 
and I will tell people that you came in here to rape me. But if you cooperate with me, you will be forever be grateful to God that you did. What is wrong with you? I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble. You are not in trouble. You are in my hands. Save my hands. Let me go. Baba, Mr. Kajola. Yeah, I'm with you. You know, this is not the first time we will be having discussion on corporate tax liability with my clients. Uh, Mr. Benson, I understand the fact that we are tax consultants and uh, we will protect the interests of your clients. However, I want you to understand the fact that I am here on this seat to protect the interests of the Federal Republic of Nigeria and the generality of Nigerians, including the two of you. You see, uh, as the Zona Text Controller, I've used my position to reduce your income, undisputable income tax liability from 20 million naira to 14.5 million naira. I mean, that's 5.5 million naira reduction. Sincerely speaking, I can't go beyond this. Again. Sir, if my memory serves me right, this is about the fifth time we are holding this meeting on the 14.5 million naira for my company. And I feel that you can actually consider the 12.5 million naira. I know it's for the government, but at the same time, I want to assure you, if you consider it, that your cola is going to be bigger this time. Uh, sir, Mr. Benson, you need to let your clients understand that this is not about me. This money is not coming to my pockets. It is about the Federal Republic of Nigeria and Nigerians. If we are not a little time now, Nigerians will be saying, government did not do this, they did not do that. These are the money they used to do those things for us. Listen, listen, let, let us take it this way. Um, let us just run it up like this. Pay 13 million naira. And let us just leave it like that. 13 million naira, nothing less. Uh, in that case, we have to go and discuss this. Okay. Uh, we'll get back to you later. Okay. No problem. Um, I'll be waiting on you. Uh, I will expect you. Thank you. Uh, so you are welcome. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank, Thank you, Mr. Benton. Kajola. You know we are friends, eh? Yeah, we are friends. <laughs> it's alright. Thank you very much. You are welcome. Thank you for coming around. It's alright. And I'll be waiting to hear from you. Alright. Yeah. Wow! <sighs> money, money, money! 13 million naira. 10 for me. Three for the Federal Republic. <laughs> Yeah, now we can think about projects. Now we can think about how to make this good. Um, my brother. Um, once you are loyal to me, I can assure you that your position as the new assistant accountant of the church is well secured. Thank you, sir. I really appreciate you. Um, however, um, as you know, the church 30th anniversary 
is around the corner. Mm. And very soon, committees will be set up mm. to handle the anniversary. I will ensure your name and my name is considered for that committee. Mm. Thank you, sir. I really appreciate your voice is my command. He who pays the piper, they taste the tune. I will let you down. Okay, no problem. Um, you know, um, the other thing is this. Um, take this. Um, that is your share of uh, last Sunday's deal, Sunday. And like I said, uh, once you remain faithful and loyal to me, you'll be well taken care of. Thank you, sir. Thank you. You are welcome. Thank you, sir. God bless you, sir. Thank you, sir. All right. Really appreciate it. Take care you, of yourself, and um, I'll see you later at the church. Thank you. Stolen waters are sweet, and the bread eaten in secret is pleasant. But he knows not that the dead are dead, and that our quest are in the depths of hell. This is the seventh time the Holy Spirit is directing me to these verses of the scripture. Ah, what is going on? Ah. Holy Spirit, sir, please give me a clearer message and understanding. Of these verses you are impressing on me. Yes, come in. Last uh, monthly program that we had. Ah, Daddy, indeed, you are the Apostle Paul of our time. Mm -hmm. Papa, my brother, God alone owes all the glory. You see, we are just privileged partners with the Lord Jesus Christ. All the signs, the wonders, and miracles you see are just the act of God towards all men. Uh, it is by grace and mercy. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank God. And Daddy, I actually, uh, the, the Lord has blessed our family with the house. And then um, I have come to specially invite you for the dedication of the house, sir. Eh? So fast? <laughs> is it not the side you told me about a few months ago? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. This is great. Congratulations, my brother. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. God bless you. Amen. On the thirtieth? Yes, the thirtieth of this month. Oh. Ah. I may not be visible at that moment. You should remember that is the date fixed for our city work crusade in South Africa. Oh, for me. How can I forget such thing? Ah. Anyway. I will send the representative. Oh, <laughs> thank you, sir. Thank you very much, Daddy. No thank problem. you, sir. And thank I will you. personally come and greet you in your new house. You are your family. Oh, that would be great. <laughs> thank you very much, Daddy. Thank you, sir. That is good. Thank you, sir. And hope you always hear from Tola, Tomisi and Yolade. Yes, sir. In fact, they will arrive in Nigeria for the house dedication by oh, the grace of God because wonderful. it actually coincides with their holidays, sir. Oh. Glory be to God. Thank you very much. Once sir. again, glory be to God. Yeah, thank you very much. Daddy. Congratulations, and much. Thank you. Look at the local government council. Unity Democrats has been declared the winner with 158, 172 votes against Allegiance Democratic Party with 10,125 votes.
Justice for all party with 5,171 votes. One voice, People's Party, nil. In Abune Local Government Council, Allegiance Democratic Party with 161,267 votes. Justice for All Party with 8,999 votes. One Voice People's Party with 7,829 votes. Unity Democratic with 2,721 votes. Allegiance Democratic Party candidate has been declared a winner by the National Electoral Commission. Ola Goria J Local Government Council. Unity Democrats with 98,981 votes. One Voice People's Party with 6,825 votes. Justice for All Party with 5,352 votes. And Allegiance Democratic Party with 98,998 votes. Michael, God has answered my prayer. <laughs> In fact, I am the happiest woman on earth. Eight weeks pregnant. <laughs> wow. Eight weeks? <laughs> yes. Praise God. Hallelujah. I'm happy for you and that you. In fact. Finally, God has done it. Yes. So... God is good. No. But God did it directly through you. And indirectly to through Daddy Jill, my husband. You do because you did it. Yes. <laughs> Please. <laughs> what is all this? What? <laughs> Please. Please. Ah, in fact. Mommy Jill. Please. If it is anything joke. I'm not joking. I'm serious. I am sorry. I won't be able to do what the party players are asking me to do. Ah, I can't do it. Chairman, the consequences of your refusal to comply with what the party leaders requested will be disastrous. I don't care, sir. I don't care. I was not voted for by the people of this community to enrich the pocket of some selfish and corrupt individuals. Really? Yes, sir. Okay. I was voted for to enrich the entire community. Entire community. Ah. Mm -hmm. Yes. Sir, giving out that large percentage of monthly allocation to some people in the party, Sir, it is ungodly, corrupt, unfaithful, disloyal act to God and people of Ola Goria D. Local government. Ah, if I keep giving such ungodly percentage to some people in the party, sir, what would I be left with to run community projects? Bravo. Elizabeth Johnson, the heroic corruption fighter. Look at you are too small to pick up a fight against the finger that fed you. No, you are too small. Look for your advantage and for your own advantage. Listen and listen carefully. Don't tear it.
My wife. My wife. My wife. Hey! Why are you holding her captive? Can't you see that she's pregnant? Why are you so wicked and heartless to be afflicting her in such manner? <laughs> and what legacy do you have to be afflicting her in this way? Your wife is a thief. <laughs> you and your lies. I know that you are not just a liar, but the father of it. And by the grace I have in Christ, I have obtained that grace. Therefore, I command you, lose your grip over her in the name of Jesus. <laughs> you are so blind and uninformed. I said your wife is a thief. Not that she stole anything from me. No. She has stolen a lot from you. The righteous judge has sent her to life imprisonment. <laughs> I am too. If I have known, I wouldn't have stolen anything. You stole? My dear, you stole? What did you steal? What did you steal? <laughs> Bring her back! Move her! Leave her in this hospital! Leave! No. You can't take her away. I said no. You can't take her away. I forbid you from taking her away. In the name of Jesus. Yeah? Hmm? Hmm? What is happening? Story Kakaki Obadio. Oku bi tauti fambe story water. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. Uh, first and foremost, we want to appreciate God in our wonderful Father in the Lord, Bishop Paul Ibalaye. Maybe represented here by our mommy. Mommy Gio. Mommy Busayo Ibalaye. You are welcome. Hallelujah. Let us appreciate mommy once again. Can we appreciate mommy once again? Uh, as we dedicate this wonderful edifice, I want to use this opportunity to let us know that it's only God that blesses without adding sorrow. Did he hear that? Did he hear that? Thief! Are you alright? I'm fine. It's just this light and the when the foundation of wealth is characterized by dubious deeds and all manners of ungodliness, that is what God refers to as stolen waters, which will always lead to calamity at the end. Good. Good pastor with anointed message. <laughs> Kajola, you will end up in calamity. I will put you in Jesus' name. Calamity. 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 Which calamity? This is this slight headache in my head that is causing some slight calamity. Sorry, sorry. Come on, Kajola. Don't be foolish. You cannot rebook me. <laughs> I am your conscience, your eternal police, the one that is here to study, to, to monitor you all around. You see, I am just here to tell you that this edifice that you built with stolen money, <laughs> that you built with inflated bills from church projects, and you are stealing government money to build, will crash. In your own very, in your own very eyes. When a man, when a man is unjust, yes. and unfaithful with God's money, 
e antes de solo. <risos> Beloved, let us be righteous in all our dealings with money. But you can see our brother here. Because of his faithfulness in handling of God's money, see how the Lord is blessing him. Oh, this pastor is getting it wrong. Kajola is a thief. Oh, are you not? Look, except you repent, confess your sin and restitute, you will surely perish with the whole of your family and everything you have built. This is enough for us all to also give our life to Christ. Is there anyone here that would like to give his or her life to Christ? To surrender your life to Christ is a great thing in life. Jesus is peaceful. Jesus is peace. Jesus is good. Jesus is prosperity. And I pray for you that the Lord will Bless all of us in Jesus' name. Amen. Shall we pray? Our Father in heaven, we thank you for what you are doing in the life of the brethren. We pray, Lord, that your spirit will do more for every one of us in Jesus' name. Amen. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Uh, now, we are going to call on our mommy. On behalf of our Father and the Lord to dedicate this house. Praise God. Hallelujah. We bless God for, for this wonderful thing that God has done. We dedicate this house in the name of the Father, Amen. Son, Amen. and Holy Ghost. I am sorry for turning down the request of the party pillars. I was so foolish. I am sorry. Please forgive me. Young man, who is this student? Ah. I am so sorry, sir. I didn't know what came over me. I was so foolish. Please don't let me be rubbish out of office. You are hot already. Ah. Haven't you been served the impeachment notice? And the party has decided to give you suspension oh. for anti-party activities. Please, sir. Sir, this time around, sir. I am ready to dance to the tune of the party pillar, sir. It is too late, Elaine Johnson. The party made you from nothingness to something great. I know what I did and what I spent to make you the chairman of Ola Goria Jejoku government. Oh. And now because you are the chairman, you think you can use your position to kick out corruption. Sir, I am sorry, sir. Rubbish. Please, sir. Rubbish. <laughs> sir, see, I have learned my lesson, sir. Please, sir. I have learned my lesson, sir. Please. can go. I will see what I can do to reverse the impeachment and the suspension. I will get back to you. Oh, thank you so much. Sir, I am not here empty handed, sir. This is your monthly monetary gift, sir. My Jew's wife. 
Ah, I'm finished. Now. I got transferred from Luku Parish to the headquarters. I ran a good car with other numerous benefits as a result of my illicit affair with the wife of a man of God who loves me so much. <sighs> it's certain that I'm already under a curse. feelings anymore. I have to go to Daddy Joe for confession. Yes. Right from the onset of my illicit affair with him. Of course, I have material gains. I became highly influential and rich in this ministry overnight. I moved from the village to the city. But I also sacrificed my peace. Now, I feel so empty and dry. Now my messages are so dry, full of dynamics and schemes. No. No. I can't cope again. I can't do this again. That the GO and the entire council of elders must hear about this. Mission accomplished. He has to go and join his ancestors. No. no. No, 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 no. I can't do that. Let him go and meet his ancestors. Ah. No, this time I can't do that. No, 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 no. I can't. You can't do it. No. Okay. No problem. <laughs> I'm waiting to read your shameful story on the pages of the next papers. Yes. Hmm. Gio's wife impregnated by Junior Pastor. Ah, wonders shall never end. Hmm. Hmm. And I trust our journalist. They will do a very good job on your story. Delete hmm. Yes. Let him go and meet his ancestors. No. I'm not here, John. Oh. Oh, John, yeah, right, right. I trust myself. Shepi, you see me. Eh, nonsense. Mm -hmm. EFCC has finally dragged me to court over the issue of 
800 million naira scandal. Ah! <laughs> no! I have it in the news. Ah! Hey! Oh, that Elegra. The Holy Spirit said I should ask you the question. Mm. Are your hands clean in this alleged scandal? So, are your hands clean? Ah, so, it is the party pillars. The very influential personalities in the party. See, my relatives, my friends, even my wife, that dragged me to this mess, sir. I'm foolish, Lisa. Are you dead? Accident. Holy Spirit warned me never, never to do that. But I told the devil there. Ah, I'm finished. God. Does it mean there are no more faithful sons and daughters who can stand for righteousness in the face of great temptations and challenges? in their various professions. Does it really mean that ah, the, the, the politics in our nation is really dirty and only the dirty ones can play it? <laughs> Brother Elegbe, <laughs> I remember several times mm. trying to reach you, but you are reach you. Ah. You are not coming to church again. Mm. Yet, the Holy Spirit impressed it on me to send you text messages of which you never replied anyone. Oh. I am very sorry. I am sorry for my disobedience. For disappointing God. God, I am sorry. Just pray for me not to go to jail. Please pray for me. I know I have disappointed God as the chairman of Olaguriaji local government. And I have frustrated his grace. Stolen waters. Father, we thank you for this prayer. Thank you, Daddy. Thank you because the confidence you have in you is that whatever we ask in prayer, you do it. Yes, Lord. Please accept our thanks in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. Amen. <sighs> thank you, Jesus. Thank God. Ah. Ah. Who is that? It's Micah. Micah. Ah, hello, Micah. Yes, how are you? Not much. All right. Please, uh, there is need for me to see you very urgently now, and I just want to come to you just now, now. Ah, but don't you think it's getting late? This is late in the night. Yes, I know, but it's very, very urgent. Please, sir, uh, I don't mind coming now. Can't it wait till tomorrow? Tomorrow morning. Please, sir. Very, very urgent, sir. Huh? It's alright. It's alright. I'll be expecting you. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. What? He, what? He, he said he has a confession to make to me and the church elders. And the confession cannot wait tomorrow morning. Ah, I ah. told him to come tomorrow morning, no, no, but no, no. he said he has to come tonight. Ah, my dear, no. You are tired. You just returned from very long journey this thing. Eh? And we just finished vigil again. Ah, you need to rest, my dear. Mm. You need to rest. Call him back. Okay. Call him to come when the day breaks. We are calling. Ah, uh, hello, Pastor Michael. Yes, sir. I'm all, almost on my way now, sir. Ah, uh, please. Can we see first thing tomorrow morning? I just finished a vigil on behalf of the church, my wife and I. And I need to rest. 
Moreover, I just came back from a long journey. Yes. So tired, my brother. Please bear with me. Ah, oh, it is well. All right, sir. Okay. I think that is right. Yes. Honey. Yeah. Yes. No, you just go. I still want to pray. Eh? Thank you. No. You can never have tried your maker. No. Impossible. You can never have tried your maker. No. Impossible. You can never have tried your creator. No. Impossible. Oh, Gori, you know you alone to hell. No. Impossible. Oh, one who even knows you alone to hell. No. Impossible. Whatever you take, you must for me. No. Impossible. Whatever you steal, you will for me. No. Impossible. Godliness and contentment. Oh. No. Impossible. It's a great gain, so says the scripture. No. Impossible. Godliness and contentment. Yeah. No. Impossible. It's a great gain, so says the scripture. No. Just do what I ask you to do. And I don't want any mistakes, please. Hmm? Okay, God bless you. <laughs> tried it. He brought cause upon himself and his household. Whatever belongs to God remains God's own. No one shares it with him. The offering in the church belongs to God. The tithes we give Belongs to God. What? Mm -hmm. And you promise it's zero tolerance to Uh, even I will do more than that. I trust 
to. Now I have peace. I'm a proud mother. Oh, you can say that again. Thank you. <laughs> ah. hmm. But I love those guys. You know, they did a clean job. Clean one. That, that's their job. They are, they are anointed to do it. Uh -huh. Yes, they have anointing for it. Wow. Yeah. Hey. That's their calling. Hey. That's their calling. Ah, they are anointed to do it. They are not that busy. Whoa, they are more daring. Okay. I'm finished. <laughs> Madam, it is well. Elders, please. I need to see the Geo. Mommy Geo and Council of Elders. As a matter of urgency, I need to see them today. Before the darkness descends, I need to see them. Uh, madam, uh, to gather everyone, today might not be possible. No! No, Elder! I want to see them! I want to see the Jew! Please! Make a free necessary! Are it meant for me? Madam, please, take it easy. Yeah. Ah! Ah! My husband is gone. Hey! <laughs> oh! Of the truth, I am the happiest man on the surface of the earth today. Look at my phone son, Komisi. You are now a graduate from one of the top most universities in the UK. With a distinction. My dear, my son is a genius. I produce a genius. <laughs> yes, so you can say that again, Dad. Yeah. Mm, Daddy, me too. <laughs> yes, of course, my daughter, you too, I do. And above all, look at us in a new big house. No <laughs> man, who are you? Who are you? Afolabi! Where is this guy? Afolabi! Who are you? Keep quiet! How can you bag into my house and I'll tell you? Oh, Why, who are you? You may, you don't know me. I'm sorry, sir. I'm sorry. Oh, I, I don't know you are the one. You are Mr. Kajola. <laughs> Is that right? Okay. Yes, sir. I'm sorry. I, I will give you money. If it is money, you want it. Clear them away, Joe. Hey. I will make sure that I add to your package. That man is a cheat. I don't want them in this life again. Oh, okay. Hey. Please, please, make sure that you don't leave any trace. Yes, yes. Hey. Good. I, 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 if it is money that you want, I will give you... Mr. Hey. Man. Ah! <laughs> 
Manofo Amblas. Yes, please, we need your attention right away. That uh, number 40. Yeah, number 40. Yeah, number 40. Uh, Have our good suite, please. Uh, Come right uh, away. Yes, yes, yes. Right away. So, Mrs. Micah, you have the floor. Thank you, sir. You are welcome. Please, you can have your seat. I would prefer to stand, sir. It's okay. So, two days before my husband died. He woke me up around 2 a.m. that he had a confession to make. Initially, I thought it was not something serious. Until when I saw him on his knee, with his face soaked with tears, then I knew there was a problem. What he told me was so disheartening. As if he knew he was going to die, he said that should make a record of his confession and keep. Can let me have it and see what it is. No, sir. As the investigating police officer in charge of my husband's case, I will hand over this item to you. All right. Please play the video. Five two. All right. Let everyone have. You can never outrun your maker. Ha! Jesus! You mean you've been having an affair with Gio's wife? Only why? I mean, why did you do this? Ha! That's not her. Tell me more. Tell me more. She begged and lured me with promise of several material blessings and promotion to flourish in Paris in the city. Ah! I'm finished. Is that why you asked me to record this? Ah! Oh God. Only why did you do this? I was foolish enough to, to succumb to her the most. And now, oh God. Now. Anna, what happened? Tell me what happened. She. She's what? She's pregnant for me. She's pregnant for me. Ah, ah, ah. My, my dear. My dear. Please, oh, Jesus, 
My dear, please, please, please. Oh God, my dear, my dear. You should be serious. What? So serious. Succeeded in waking me up that night, but I wasn't myself. I was so depressed, and I threatened him that he should go and make a confession to the GO within 24 hours. If not, I will kill myself, sir. That was what <coughs> was going to tell you, sir. That early morning, that some guys came me and they killed my husband. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. You saw you. You did all this? This shameless dog killed my husband. She killed my husband to hide a shameless act. Mommy Gio, why did you kill my husband? Why? You should have killed him. Why? Madam, you are under arrest. For further investigation of the murder case of Pastor Michael Johnson. Officer, Please. copper. Please. Stand up. Stand up and move now. I move you. Madam, stand up. That is <laughs> So, you mean these two are members of the church too? Yes, sir. They killed the Kaka and his family members. My God. But why? So you know. You were sent by new assistants at Kanta to the church. Inshallah, Anika. Exactly, sir. We gather that they have a group in the church with members in different branches of the church. What this group does is stealing and diverting church money for personal use. They have different manipulative methods through which they divert church tithes, offerings, and various collections into different accounts owned by the crew. Ah! My God! Oh God. You know they did steal from George Money. Now business we did. You shut up there! When you get to court, you have that to see him. The guy will not go to die that guy. Huh? Everybody will die. Now I think. My only prayer is say if I get to that place, meet Jesus, remember me. My my God. God. You Jesus! <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Shut up your mouth. We are believing like I want about. Who? You! We are head the shine so like we're not from me. I don't forget. Okay. Who? You go see him now. Go chop your beans, bro. See, 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 see your eye cleaning out like you. 
You don't go shut up your mouth. I praise you for us. And I beat the people I passed on. I now remember. Remember what's that? In Revelation. In Revelation? Yes! Oh, 